Hello everyone, I am back on my channel. Today's topic is about how many ounces of perfumes and colognes are allowed to mail using post office service. But this service will be a domestic only. Please don't forget to share, like, and subscribe and stay tuned for more information. Let's begin. I know it is very prohibited on post office administration, the perfume and cologne. Perfume and colognes are part of hazardous materials. These products are contains alcohol. It means it's very flammable. It's not allowed to, to mail. It's not allowed to put in the mail stream. But this is considered for class three hazardous materials and are considering this to a uh, special mailing requirements. What does it mean? It has to be in a proper way to do it and it's only allowed for for mailing service uh, the perfume and cologne are only be shipped domestic only. Post office accept perfumes and colognes for only domestic service not um, international. I don't think international you can allow to um, mail perfume and colognes because like i said it's very hazardous materials it is contains a alcohol it can cause a fire and it's very flammable but anyway the only way you can uh, mail this perfume the only allowed the quantities allowed only 16 ounces per glass or plastic container so think about that 16 ounces two cups because one cup is eight ounces so two cups i'm sorry i'm not good my math i'm i'm not smart okay my math is bad all right so two cups of the quantities of the perfume it means it's a lot so let's say for this sparkling water yeah let's say this is like 17 ounces so less of this so it's a lot of contain it's a lot of perfume that you can allow to mail but that's what it say but not exit for 16 ounces uh i know there's a big bottle of the perfume so you are allowed to mail perfume or cologne uh, using post office but you can only do a ground service not priority you cannot use this um, box if you are sending perfume or cologne you have to use the the recycle um, box like Amazon or recycle the one that you bought in the stores uh, like the dollar store so you can use this one because we have to you we have to do like a ground service post office would automatic to use the mailing for ground service and that's it why it's ground because the ground uh it goes by trucking the ground the transportation will be trucking priority i believe they go to uh like using plane that's why it's a little bit faster so this one it has to go by plane so it's not allowed to send priority mail when you want to mail a perfume so it has to be ground in the ground surface only and the post office clerk will put they will put uh, some kind like a label here it says surface only so as long as you tell the clerk it is a perfume or cologne they know what to do and do not make an argument with that because I know a lot of people said that, oh, we mail perfume. So why you didn't why you didn't tell me it's not allowed to mail priority? Well, you did not tell us. And if that happened, you make an argument to the clerk. You are not listening. If something happened to the uh, incidents, like plane got fire on fire, if something a big happened, you are gonna be responsible. So you don't want that. And you keep sending perfume using you lie about it using priority box and you didn't tell the clerk of course they are going to trace the and you are responsible of what's happening so you do not lie especially on international a lot of customer does it they lie they send it 
and you're wondering why your package did not arrive and come back to you because you put a hazardous on it like household and mainly perfume or alcohol you do not lie because the custom will check it and then they're gonna return it to you and then the posted it is not a refundable it's just a waste of money and it's a big circle and it's not worth it if i were you just just listen all right if i were you don't do it okay and um okay another thing that i would like to advise to you guys is you have to pack the box you need to put some kind of like uh support uh, to the box like because I know perfume they're breakable I know perfume it's pretty they're fragile so you need to put a support on it so that it won't got damaged it won't got destroyed so you need to some kind like a cushion on it uh, wrap it good put more some kind like things that can absorb in case something happen on the box at least it can absorb to the materials that um the materials that you support but um pack properly on your own before going to post office the post office will mail it for you and then they will do the processing uh service and don't forget to label your uh to label your box address it from you know where it's going properly and correct and also um as long as you told the post office uh, clerk that it is a perfume and a uh, cologne and they will put some kind of like a sticker here it says surface only some kind of like a label like like the post office hat and do not lie about it all right i have some videos that you can look at it to check it out if you came across for doing mailing shipping service and please let me know if this video helps you to prepare doing mailing and shipping service using post office i will talk to you soon if you have any question please leave me a comment below. I will try as fast as I could. And please double check the description box below. Thank you so much. Bye.